Hi everybody and welcome to the new video in Exploring Expressions, a video series which is designed to help people understand what the expressions are within Power Automate. Expressions being the low code functions that we have available to us to perform data manipulation while the flow is actually running. Today we're going to be looking at replace, another one of the string expressions that allow us to effectively look for a combination of characters inside a set string and replacing it with something else. This could be really useful in terms of maybe replacing names, replacing specific pieces of information uh, that are coming through maybe from emails, from uh, Teams messages, wherever the, wherever the flow of data is, we can do a replace. Let's actually have a look at this in, in action then. So I have a compose which I've initially got my uh, my string set up in and it says today is Monday and it is actually sunny here in the UK. Now, as this runs, I am going to change Monday to Tuesday because the day I'm recording this is a Tuesday. But I'm not going to do that by just changing the inputs because when we're doing this in a real scenario, this data is most likely going to be dynamic. So I'm going to use my compose action and I'm going to uh, for my results and I'm also going to use the replace action to replace Monday with Tuesday. So let's come and select my uh, my expression editor and if I just expand out my see more for my string functions for the moment, you can see here that I have replace in the list. And what it's asking me for are three different parameters. It wants the text, i.e. what is the string the entire string where we want to perform the manipulation, what is the old text, what is it we're going to look for, and the new text, what are we going to replace it with. So in this case, I'm going to be taking the string from my, uh, my original compose, I'm going to look for the word Monday, and I'm going to replace it with Tuesday. Let's do it. So if I go to type in replace, again the first thing it wants is the initial string. So I'm going to come back to my compose string one and select the outputs. And then I'm going to put a comma. Remember, this could be a different character depending on your geographic settings for your machine. I'm then going to choose um, the string that I want to look for. Now this needs to go in single quotes. So I'm going to select Monday. I'm going to put one more final comma because remember I need to give it three parameters. What do I want to replace Monday with? I want to replace it with Tuesday. Once I've done that, let's press add, let's save it, and let's go and run it. Okay, so my flow runs, my original compose, my original string, today is Monday, and it's actually sunny here in the UK. And I replace the Monday with the Tuesday, all in flight, all by using expressions. So there we go, that's the replace expression. Very, very simple to use, but a very, very powerful expression for you to be able to really take advantage of when your flow's in, uh, in flight, and it's there to actually do those replaces, to change one part of a string for something else. Very, very simple, very, very powerful. I hope you enjoyed the video, I hope you found it useful. Uh, if you do find it useful and you think somebody else could also benefit from this, please do share it, please give it a like, because the more people that I can educate, the more people I can help with flow, uh, the better and the more and the more I can do these videos. But for now, I hope you all have a great day and I look forward to seeing you in the next video.